yo, yo, what is up, what is up, it's me, it's me, it's Key, and I am back in the building, another video, a little recap of my uh, Sixers last night, get the win, um, ooh, the 125, the 108, I think it was, in today's story, Jake Bowden comes off the bench, gives us 31, y'all. 31 points. I'm loving Shake and, and, and uh, Tyrese Maxey coming off the bench and, and definitely contributing. They definitely know how to run a pick and roll. Um, and then Maxey came off the bench. Yeah, he had 16 points, I think it was. This kid is awesome. He's not afraid to shoot. He goes in the lane. Um, he hustles. He rebounds. So Tyrese Maxey is definitely... Definitely, definitely, definitely going to be here uh, for years to come. Um, again, Shake had 31 points off the bench. Shake was killing him from the three as well. Um, JoJo, he didn't. He had an okay game. He only had nine points. But what do you expect? Um, the Miami Heat was not going to get burnt by a JoJo again. Of course, they made some adjustments this time around. So he only had nine points. Andy Green, he contributed with 16. Um, Tobias had 12, I believe. Oh well, yeah, man, overall it was it was a good game. Um, they shot well from the three. And so what y'all say? What what key? What the Ben Simmons do? Eh, he, yeah, he had triple. Yeah, he had a triple double. He was four for eight with 10 points. I still feel like he needs to do more. He actually attempted to shoot a three yesterday, and it hit the rim. This is my thing I don't understand. If you're so-called working on this shot, and you're mid-range, and we've seen the videos of it, you would think half the time that he does attempt to take a shot, it would go in. And nobody was nowhere near you at the top of the key. That should have been a good basket. The simple fact that you attempted it was shocking to me. Because that's your third three of the season that you attempted. One's went in so far. Um, when they leave you wide open like that, Ben, why just... Take a chance to just shoot it every time. Every time. Make them say, oh snap, wait a minute. Ben is going to be shooting each time we leave him open. Maybe they'll start to play defense on you, but nobody does. If you look in the NBA so far, everyone who's played Ben Simmons, they do not play no defense on him. They will double team someone else. They will double team Joel Embiid. They will double team Seth Curry. Everybody else is double team but Ben. So yeah, Ben had two more shots than he did the other game. And more points. Yes, he facilitates the ball. Why? Because he's not going to shoot. He's going to drive the lane and kick out and find open three. You're a 6'10 and you decide to kick out the ball instead of just going in for an easy layup or a dunk. I still will not understand it. But I'm not gonna rant on Ben Simmons on this video like I did last week, like I did the other day. Um, I don't want to steal no thunder from Shake Milton. Scoring again, 31 points again. I like Maxi and and um, Shake coming off the bench. I think either Shake can get a best, you know, improved player of the year, or definitely six man of the year because he has been great coming off as a six man. Um. And playing very well. So, and again, it got to say Joe B didn't really, you know, do much last night. He only had nine points, but that night before he had 45 points. So again, I was expecting Eric Spoelstra to um, change his game plan up a little bit. But overall, Sixers played played well. Uh, we're still waiting to get Seth Curry back in the offense, and then things will be. I think things will be moving again, and we'll be back to dominating the way we've been dominating games. Um, so, 
Let me know what you think about last night's game. Shake Milton scoring 31 points. Uh, comment, like, and subscribe to the channel. If you need more of your Philly news, I got you covered from the Flyers, Sixers, Eagles, and the Phillies. <laughs> Don't forget as well to check out uh, Spotlight Sports Network as well. Uh, you finally got you'll find me over there as well. Check out the podcast that do on the, the divisional rounds, divisional uh, playoff games that's coming up this weekend. Uh, so you don't want to miss that. Um, some live play by play will be done this weekend over there uh, for the games. And um, yeah, so the Flyers will play tonight as well. Seven o'clock, the puck drops. We got the Pittsburgh Penguins yet again. Um, get home too late to try to do that. But we're going to definitely, definitely be bringing you some Flyers content, guys. So, um, and also, again, go to the website www.spotlightsportsnetwork.com. Go get your merch from Key in the Building merch. Again, we got hats, hoodies. T-shirts, we name it, we got it. Mass. And as always, guys, happy Fridays to you. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. And as always, I'm in the building. I'll see y'all in a little bit.